Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So glad to have you guys here with me today. Uh, before we get any further into the video, let me just go ahead and throw this out there. If you're new here, consider subscribing. Let's grow this channel into a beautiful channel. If you enjoy the video, give it a thumbs up too. Anyway, uh, the I just fed and uh, changed my uh, baby, and now he's taking a nap. And uh, now we're gonna do a video. How about that? And uh, speaking of baby, I bought a product a while ago because number one, I needed it. Number two, hey. It, it makes for great content, or so I think, especially for this channel where I look at a lot of scented things, and uh, that is Baby Dove. That's right, Baby Dove. Let me get my big head out the way. Baby Bar. Anyway, um, I, I just realized this too. I didn't. I, I just realized that, like the you got the big bird and then the little bird. In the logo, that's pretty cool. Milder and more nourishing than ordinary baby soap. Says rich moisture. That's what that's what you really need in a baby soap. You gotta gotta have a soft skinned baby. You don't want your baby to have dry ass skin like you. You know, ashy elbows and stuff. Hypoallergenic, of course. That's what you need. Created with no dyes, no parabens, no phthalates, no sulfates. Uh, 3.17 ounces. I forget what I gave for this. I purchased this at Walmart. Uh, you know, like I said, mainly for the fact that uh, I'm going to need it. But our caring formula is hypoallergenic. Uh ophthalmologist, dermatologist, and pediatrician tested. Isn't that crazy? That's uh, where I read that in that little box there. Anyway, even smart label uh, accessible questions or comments, 1-800-761-DOVE. Uh, this is a Unilever product, and it even tells you how to use the product. It says, how to use Baby Dove Rich Moisture Baby Bar is mild and nourishing, ideal for daily use. Wet baby's hair and skin with warm water and wash gently with hands or washcloth. Follow with Baby Dove Rich Moisture Lotion to lock in moisture for 24 hours. And we use that too. Works really good. Very, very, very good baby lotion. Uh, the Hello Bella lotion I have found to be pretty good too. Uh, and I've only used a handful and only one of them I'm not a, that big of a fan of. But you know what? I'm not going to talk about it because that's not what this video is about. We're talking about Baby Dove. <coughs> Excuse me. Baby Dove Rich Moisture Bar with our quarter moisturizing cream goes beyond mildness to replenish skin essential nutrients that help skin maintain its natural moisture for baby skin that is soft, nourished, and delicately scented. And uh, you gotta love that. It smells like that fresh, clean baby. You know, that classic clean baby smell, fresh out of the shower, the bath, I mean, the sink bath, the tub bath, the little bucket bath. You know what I'm saying? It, it has that, like, very cute, huggable, smellable, kissable smell. And uh, you gotta love it. Anyway, let's uh, stop talking about the packaging. Let's take a look at the inside. and Let's see what Dove... I've actually never used Baby Dove soap. I used liquid. So, look at that. It looks just like uh, your typical Dove bar. Kind of the curvature going on. Once again, I love the fact that they added that little detail of the uh, the little mini, the baby bird there with the mama bird or papa bird, I guess. I don't know. Uh, and it's even on the other side, too. It's on the inside. So you got it. This one looks a whole lot better than the, than the other one, though. I will say that. Uh, it looks like a bunch of Pringles stacked up on top of each other. Uh, now, of course... Um, now, Dove is a large brand. 
they're not typically known for their all natural ingredients or stuff like that but baby soap is baby soap uh it, it's it's very welcomed and you know for pediatricians and stuff they recommend the stuff okay so you know i i as a person try to use products that are natural and um like less harsh as possible on the skin and body but you don't always get that so this makes my baby skin feel good, and uh, I, I, that's all I want. You know, he's happy, I'm happy. Anyway, it's a definitely like a uh, white, an off-white color with a slight yellowish tint, and it feels very, very smooth. I love it. Uh, now, with Dove being a massive brand, like a massive brand, uh, these are mass produced. So, uh, you know, they just come, they're pooped out of a machine and boxed up and packaged up and sent on the way. So, of course, they got, um, it, they got kind of like a, uh, like a, I, I'm trying to think how, it's almost like it was pressed in a dye or something. You know what I'm saying? It's like it was poured in a dye and then popped out and then shipped right into a package. So, it is what it is. But it's very smooth, and it doesn't, it, it like, on top here, and that, that's what I'm considering the top, is very smooth, uh, dry, and uh, all around soft. Now, underneath, it, it, it's starting to feel like a little wet, a little moist, if you will, a uh, little bit more rough, not as soft as the top, but... Uh, you know, no big deal. Anyway, let's get into the smell. How about that? And uh, then we'll talk a little bit more about the bar itself. <sighs> oh, wow. Just dropped it. Shit. Anyway. So, one thing I will note is that... This, it, even though it does say delicately scented, I do feel as if it is strongly, strongly more scented than the liquid. And it, it, it may just be me, but uh, the scent in the liquid form, the, the, like the same brand, but in a liquid form, is not um, as, it's not as strong, of course, and they don't even smell identical in my opinion not that it matters because this still smells good it still has that baby fresh smell but now i'm starting to smell a little bit of like a like a floral undertone like you know what i'm saying if that makes any sense it smells like a little bit like flowers hmm and it smells good and like i said it does have that classic uh baby fresh smell so there's that, with just a little bit of a flowery smell. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Uh, warnings are for external use only. Avoid direct contact with eyes. If product gets into eyes, rinse thoroughly with water. Keep out of reach of children, except under adult supervision. Obviously, because this is a child's product. It's made for a child, but to clean a child, and a baby, rather... Um, so, yeah, don't let your baby wash themselves, I guess. Ingredients, I'll, I'm not even going to attempt to, uh, ramble off those, but there is the ingredients list if you want to pause the video and take a peek, okay? See, uh, if, if it's for you. Anyway, all in all, I will, um, I'm going to, I'm just going to rate it as if I've used it before, okay? and But I'm going to keep the fact that I haven't used it quite yet in mind when I, when I tell you what I think about it. Number one, the packaging. I'm not, you know, is what it is. The packaging is, is very cute. I, it's lovable. It's, you know, with especially, I you know, I just realized that today, the little baby. That's cool. Um, it adds a little something extra for the purchaser, the consumer. 
you know, especially parents, they see that and they're just like, oh, that's just so adorable. That's just so cute. <laughs> I got that. I want it. And uh, it, it's exactly what you need to know. It's a baby soap. Scent wise, it uh, it like I said, it does smell um, a whole lot different than the liquid form, but not in a way that that kind of takes away from it. If that makes any sense at all, it still smells really good, just slightly different. It and, and it changes it drastically at the same time. Uh, it kind of takes it in a separate direction. Like I still kind of smell. Uh, what they were going for, but it just it's just a tad bit different for some reason. With that being said, uh, it, you know I'd still use it on my child, and if I was to smell that on my child, uh, at a scale of one to ten, that that would at least easily be an eight and a half. It would smell good. My baby would smell fresh, baby fresh. Uh, value, I think this was like two dollars or under. Uh, that's not that bad, especially for. Uh, a 3.17 ounce bar of soap, so that's like less than a dollar per ounce. That's very affordable. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys very much for uh, peeking your heads through the crack and uh, checking this video out. I really do appreciate it. And once again, if you're new here, consider subscribing. I do videos like this relatively regularly. Um... It has been disrupted, of course, because I do have a infant, and yeah, and I work full time, twelve hours a day, six days a week, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, I'll see you in the next video.